All right, guys, I am back for a quick little one here. I'm gonna show you how I glue my pages together, like, or not pages, pockets together. Um, we are completely dry and she's already kind of a chunky monkey. So, yeah, so let's, let's start. Um, one of the biggest tips I can give you when you're gluing these pockets together is try to make sure your spine is sitting upright and it gets harder once you get back, right? But what you wanna do is be able to, um, it not to pull, right? right? All right, so let's do the first one. And I always go to the opposite side here and we already know we want this. And actually, you know what guys? This is the first video I filmed in like a couple of days. So a lot has happened in the last few days. I actually have something to report. Um, so um, I went to dinner, Grace and I did with my boss and he is a super nice guy. Um, I mean, I'm still pretty nervous about, you know, that. I mean, I met him obviously Monday at work, but then, you know, we went to dinner with him. Um, and he was so fascinated with Grace, which, I mean, I don't blame him. She is pretty cool. I'm talking about my boss. Oh. And so, yeah, they, um, they had quite the conversation. Um, I think it's been a while since a guy has actually impressed Gracie. So that was pretty awesome. Um, Let's see, what else can I report to you? Um, uh, let's see. Um, so you guys already know about Bo's new car. Um, one of the big happenings that's happening, um, all you, by the time you see this, it will have already happened, I think. So, I mean, but I'm not gonna talk about it just in case I got my days wrong for scheduling. Um, so let's see, what, el what else is happening in the Farrago household? Um, boy, kids, I don't know. Um, So yeah, I mean, gluing these in, it, 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 it took a long time because I, I mean, this isn't my first altered book, but it did take me a long time to kind of get the hang of gluing these pockets down and together um, because if not, they kind of shift on you. Okay, of course the dogs are barking now, right? Of course they are. Because I started the video, right? So, and then the next videos, I'm not going to glue all of them with you guys because I know you guys get like so crazy bored with it. Um, but anyways, um, um, and I got to go fix dinner here in a few minutes, but um, let's see, what was I? Oh, Gracie, are you still out there? Oh, she must have went outside. Anyways, um. So I don't know if you guys, I mean, a lot of you, like, it's kind of almost a natural progression for some of us. Like there's things that we're definitely interested in. And then, um, let's see, this one, we're just going to glue here at the bottom. Um, but Gracie's really been into like pressed flowers all summer. And so, um, some of the really small flower presses were like 25, 30 bucks online. But, um, did I glue that already? I did not. Look at that. Gotta glue that down. Anyways, um, so I did some research, she did some research, and we decided to do cutting boards. 
And maybe in the next video, if she doesn't come back in the house right away, in the next video, I'll we'll show you what she made. Okay, so these pockets, that's another reason why I'm doing this. I'm only gonna go down this right here, the like this, almost like the center seam, all the way down, and then it becomes four pockets. Oh, she did come back in. Maybe we can get her to go get it and bring it here. Gracie, no. you're gonna come show them the uh, board that you made, the pressing board. So anyways, um, it's basically two cutting boards from Walmart. Go ahead and slip it in here. Oop, 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 baby. Can you grab that? It's like a handful over here. Okay, so it's basically two cutting boards from Walmart. And then she, um, I helped her, helped her hold it, but um, then we drilled holes through two of the cutting boards. And then we got the washers and the screws or bolts, I guess these are actually called. And then um, she's got some nuts. Oh, gosh darn it. She's got some, uh, um, uh, 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 bolts or nuts that she's going to go ahead and um, finish that off with. So anyways, all right, so Can back to this. Or will it cause a mismatch set? Oh, no, you can use them. They're for, I only use one per cover. So... Oh, I didn't mean you actually used them for that. I do. That is actually what they are used for. So anyways, you want to show them some of your fresh flowers if you still have that handy? Okay. Um, the other screw fell down on the ground. Did you grab it? I got it. Okay. Um, did you, we showed them the frame that I did with the first set, right? Did we? I think so. I don't know. Maybe that video just hasn't aired yet. I can't remember. Well, yeah, but I'm like, I'm going to say the 15th, 14th. Today's the 14th. And I have videos recorded up until next Saturday. So seven days away. So seven videos ago, videos ago, you could have had that. I forgot I needed to nail this. Are you going to the post office anytime soon? Yeah, because I got that notice. What is it? This is the thank you card for my scholarship. Okay. It's not like past due. I just keep forgetting to mail it. Yeah, that's fine. I don't know if you you showed me, but I don't remember. All right, come over here while I'm gluing. And just kind of show them, explain, tell them exactly which flower is what. I have no idea other than that's a cactus flower. Um, this is technically upside down, but I thought this side was cooler because you can see like the cactus flesh, I guess, on it. This was the yellow flower. I missed all of our orange flowers though by like probably two days. Yeah. Um, and then these purple ones actually were orange flowers and they dried purple. Um, and I got some more and dried them just to make sure I wasn't like on crack that they were purple when I dried them. Mm. I tried to dry some morning glories just to see what they would do. They didn't turn out very great. I didn't think they would, but those are the morning glories. They kind of look gross, <laughs> but they're not like shaped right really for um, this kind of thing. What is that bush out there that I stole these yellow ones from? Do you know? Um, they used to call them butterfly bushes, but I don't know that that's really its name. It's one my grandma and grandpa planted, so I have no idea really. I took all those from that. Um, here's a, another sunflower-esque one. It's a wild doozy. Um, Where we are, we kind of get more of like the pra prairie wildflowers, like these ones. I don't really know what they're called. I feel like I've heard them called bonnet tops before. Uh, that could be. I don't know. Because they're just like, this is a tiny piece of one, but they're just like 
round and kind of flattish kind of I don't know but I squished it so that's what those look like and then these are more of the orange flowers that dry purple and I'm kind of actually salty that they dry purple because I really wanted them to be orange there are more of those Um, and then I found a bunch of wild snapdragons. Um, like bright blue wild snapdragons. And I dried, I didn't really know how to dry a snap, or like press a snapdragon. So I just kind of put them all in a bunch of different positions and hoped for the best. Oh, they turned out really cute. Yeah. Ah! Here are all the loose wild snapdragons. And then, um, I really like those ones. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I like the vibrant color of them. Uh -huh. I like saw them out of the corner of my eye and I was like, what is that? And then it was wild snapdragons. Um, and then, this is like, this. I don't know if it's glaring, but this is a snapdragon stem and I think that looks pretty cool. And then these ones are, you can't really see it that well. They're called, they're prettier when they're actually flowers. They dry kind of weird and they're really like, really soft. Um, they're called bull thistle or that's what my boss calls them. Um, okay. oh, All right. That's my collection. That's your collection so far? You know what would have been smarter to do on this one instead of making it like a large tag thing? It would have been to put the glue here. Oh, a little too late now. Too late now. You better make sure that pair of scissors makes it back over here, girly girl. Yeah, yeah. Don't you yeah, yeah, yeah me. One of our scholars um, says that a lot. Yeah, yeah. Uh -huh, like you'll say... Um, like, good job, so and so, and he's like, yeah, yeah. <laughs> okay, so the, I don't think everybody here knows what what you mean by like Ram Scholars. Um, so Gracie is part of a pilot program, um, and she's interning um, with uh, adults that have special needs, um, so that they can um, take college courses to help them in their future endeavors in the ag industry. Um, and it's going really well. Um, though I will say, I think her patients have been tested to their to their fullest this summer. What do you think? Yes, yeah, probably. Yeah, working with special needs um, people takes a whole lot of patience and a whole lot of time. Um, but it's rewarding. So, oh, and her cat's being obnoxious again. She wants aggressive cats. Oh. All right, maybe, I was like, maybe we will get it all glued, but then I just looked at the other half of the book and realized I'm not even halfway done. It's all good. It's all good. Okay, so I'll glue a couple more while, while I have you here. And then, like I said, I'm gonna pause it, or not pause it, I will end the video, and then the next one you see, we'll start in on the cover. And I've got a couple of different ideas and techniques I wanna try. Um, and again, it's going to be kind of hit and miss. And like I said, the, like I said, the most important tip I can give you is to make sure the spine is as, as 90 degrees as you can make it. Um, because if not, it gets glued kind of cockeyed um, or like, see like now I can open this up and pull it and this part gives if not then um and this one's a little bit like that you can see where it's not quite lined up right let me see if i can throw some ink on it to where you can actually kind of see it okay see how that this pocket isn't quite lined up with that which is still okay but the more see the more flush you can get this edge right here the better right that way it doesn't there's no awkward warping or anything like that okay all right let's see where were we get that one get those we're on to this one okay all right all right 
guess another important tip would be remember your book can move with you, right? Where is that music coming from? I wonder if it's one of the renters. But I heard kind of like an announcer voice over... Um, not till August. Oh. I was thinking that earlier too, but I kind of heard like an announcer, almost like a little rodeo thing or something going on right down this road, like um, over by Bob Webb's new house. That could very well be. Mom, look, everybody watch. Scissors are going back up on the wall. Okay, good girl. They're all proud of you. I know they are. That was more for my future safety. <laughs> Grayson, where did my scissors go? I hey. promise I put them back. We have witnesses. Gracie, come look at my cup over here and look to see what I found. That gray cup right there. Right, in, like the first one with that roller. Oh, where'd you find it? Not where it was supposed to be. There's one right here, too. No, that one's the one with the hook in it. Well, there's still one right there. Oh, but Where it was it? It was over there in some of the tools. Mm -hmm. Um, do you have a piece of paper? Um, by the computer. All right. Or uh, uh, printer, I mean. Oh, you know what the other thing I'm going to do tonight before I go to bed is I got to print out Amy's graphics so that I can start filming tomorrow on the challenge which I'm starting like way early this year I'm hoping that that is a good sign oh, all right I'll glue this one and then we'll then we'll call it a video. And then, like I said, the next one you see, we will be painting and making the cover all, all pretty. So yeah, um, I will talk to you guys in a little bit. Bye.